Hello everybody, DrumKid92 here, bringing you another Talking It Out episode. Um, this time, face cam. Because guess what? I have a face cam now, so I can do this stuff. Um, I just wanted to bring you guys up to speed on what's been going on. Um, I had an eight-hour shift at work today, uh, where I got some great news. Um, the company had a competition going around as to... Um, because the managers all went to the manager conference uh, a couple of weeks ago, and while they were gone, um, Madden uh, NFL 2013 was released, and so there was kind of a competition to see who of the managers, the lower level managers that were left behind to man the stores while the store managers were gone, see who could sell the most in the district. Um, apparently I won. Um, I'm just a senior game advisor, not technically management position, but at my store we don't have an assistant store manager, and I'm the I've been there the longest, so I'm considered their senior, senior game advisor. <laughs> That's stupid. Um, so I got put into the ranking of the assistant store managers, um, so I had to kind of, like, compete with them, and apparently I won. I didn't well, I wasn't even trying. Um, and so I guess I win, like, a $100 gift card. Cool. So that was pretty sweet. Um, I probably won't get the full 100 amount, um, because then they had a competition for the senior game advisors, um, which there are the other two at my store, uh, and of the whole district, one of them won the $25 gift card that was to be awarded to them. Um, so my store won both, which is kind of funny. Um, it was actually like, um, it wasn't just the most Madden sales, it was the m biggest improvement over your last year's Madden sales, um, I believe was a factor in it at least. Um, and so that helped out, definitely. Um, but yeah, so apparently I won that. I don't think I'm going to get the full amount of the 100 because I think my store manager wants to kind of spread it out between the three of us a little bit. Um, but there is 125 to go around. He said I would get the most since you know, I sold the most and helped out the most. Um, so I'll probably wind up with like 60 or 70 of it, and then they'll each get you know, 30, 25, 30, um, which I'm fine with because the past few months I've been slowly adding money onto my pre-orders for this fall. Um, and I don't owe much on any of them, so that gift card should last me for a couple months, um, provided I don't spend any money on stupid games that I won't ever play, like pre-owned stuff. Like, oh, this is a cool collector's edition, I better buy this, <laughs> like I do all the time. Um, so try and hold off on that, since I just bought this $250 PVR. Blech. Um, yeah, so eight and a half hour shifts, I'm a little tired. Um, I played a prank on Halo Freak the other day because at GameStop we're doing this giveaway um, where if you come in with your DS you can get a free Pokemon his name's Caldeo um, and it just like goes through a sharing thing and you get them for free if you come into the store I don't know if it's every GameStop but it's most of them at least it's mine at least um, I think it's most of them but um, so we have these posters of this Pokemon and it's really really dumb looking let me try and find one that Halo Freak didn't write on. Um, <laughs> okay, he kind of wrote on this. But, um, that's the Pokemon. So it looks pretty gay. Um, <laughs> and so I grabbed all these posters from work, and while Halo Freak was in the kitchen, I, like, tacked all of them up on his wall, like, all over the place. And so he walked in his room and he was like, hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, college pranks. Good good roommate stuff. Um, and then when I came home from work, he had taken all of them and written, like, this stuff on the back and drew a bunch of penises and put it all over my room. And so I walked into my room and was just like, I loves penis! And, like, dicks drawn everywhere. <laughs> uh, and then on the door, he had put, Payback's a bitch, isn't it? <laughs> uh good times. So that's what I wanted to do after my eight hour shift is come home and peel those off the wall. But it was funny. All in all in good taste. Pretty good taste. Um, oh, also be right back. Ugh. From the manager's conference they got these um I can't figure this out. There we go. Killzone Hellgast helmets. Um, pretty sweet. Like, nice detail on them. Um, and my manager didn't want his, so he let me take that. Um, what else? I got a Call of Duty shirt. 
Um, Pro Evolution soccer shirt that looks kind of cool, but I don't care about, but it looks cool. Um, I got a Luigi hat. Uh, something else. I don't remember what else. But I got my manager was really nice, and he brought us all back a bunch of stuff. So, good guy manager. Um, that was pretty cool. Um, oh, also, I um, cause I like buying random shit that has no point in being in my room or in my possession at all, and I have to then collect all of it once I buy one piece of it. And so there are these pop figures that are Plants vs Zombies figures, and I went out and I bought all of them. This is weird trying to reverse it. So, all right, it'll take a while to get used to that. There's the regular zombie. And there's the conehead zombie. And then, of course, the pea shooter. So those are the five that are out right now. So I had to go and buy those. I don't know anymore, guys. <laughs> I don't know why I do what I do anymore. Oh, man. Money. It's crazy. Um... Yeah, I think. Oh, also, this was on sale, ten bucks off. So I got Terra online. Haven't installed it yet. Um, I've been playing some WoW. I mentioned this in another video. I've been playing some WoW with Halo Freak and uh, the girl I work with, fiance Andy. Um, we've been playing a little bit of WoW, so I probably won't have time for that in a little while. But it was on sale, and I've been wanting to try it, so I have it now. Woo! Um. I think that's it. Um, <clears throat> as for stuff that's going on, classes are going pretty well. Um, they might be transferring me to another GameStop, like a mall location, which I'm not looking forward to because it'll be way busier. I mean, the shifts will go by faster because when you're busy, time moves faster. But um, I, uh, I like being able to be lazy. Um, I really like being able to be lazy. <laughs> um, yeah, whatever. Seems like a good spot to end it. Seven and a half minutes. Okay. Um, like if you like, sub if you want to sub, and you want to get updated as to when I upload new videos. Um, stuff I have going on right now, I'm going to be recording some Mass Effect with my brother, the online Mass Effect 3 with my brother pretty soon. Um, once I get closer to finishing Metro 2033, I believe I'll start in on a console game playthrough. I'm thinking Resident Evil 4 Professional difficulty. That's what I'm thinking. Sounding good. Sounds mighty tasty. Because I know that game in and out, and it would probably be fun for you guys to watch me like rape the shit out of that game on the hard difficulty. Um, and then Halo Freak and I need to record some stuff coming up here soon. Maybe even tonight. Maybe. Maybe tonight. Because, um, like I said in my other video, I'm looking to turn um, our Adventure Time series into an Adventure Map series. So, I mean, there's not really a whole lot he and I can do on that world. Um, I don't know. We just started it because it seemed fun and like a weird, quirky thing to do, and we like Adventure Time. And I think we got what we wanted out of it. Um, so we might do just like a farewell episode for the world, and then we'll start in on adventure maps and things, or maybe we'll just go into adventure maps. I don't know, man. It's all up in the air. It's all all around me, up in the air. <sighs> um, I believe that does it. Thank you guys for watching. Yeah, yeah, that's it. <laughs> I'm kind of spacey right now. Anyways, thank you guys for watching again. And I'll catch you all next time on whatever video I upload. Bada boom, bada bing.